Kat. I'm Lori. And we're Babes in Toyland, and you're watching... 120 Minutes. Three, four... I came to Minneapolis from San Francisco, and I didn't really know anybody. And I wanted to start a band, and I saw... This is my version. <laughs> I saw Lori dancing at First Avenue all the time just by herself. A really great dancer, a really good rhythm. And I, then I met her at a barbecue party, and I said, Do you know how to play drums? And she said, I have a set, but she didn't know how to play. And I thought, perfect. She's going to be perfect. At the time, I was working with a band out of Minneapolis, Run Westy Run, and I bought the drummer's drums. Because I would talk about drumming for years, and then uh, I just had them in my attic, like this closet attic, yeah. just sitting there. And I was always just, I don't know, I had no idea what, how to use them or anything. I still don't actually, but <laughs> no. And so we just started, the first time I ever played was the first time Kat and I practiced. Yeah. And it just kind of like, we what, we started practicing like five days a week after the first time I ever jammed. I was like, this is fun. And it I was like, fun because it was, was just really basement fun. casual and we'd drink and just kind of, someone just described her as um, Bam Bam and Pebbles mixed. It's like that too, just like, kum, 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 kum. just like, here, play. It's good. Yeah, so I just basically never played before. Album. So, album came out on Twin Tone. We Same recorded it in Seattle. Oh, okay, yeah. 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 We just, we just slaughtered like 17 songs in a day, two days or something. Yeah, like a day and a half. Really just like that. And, and we used two on a sub pop single and one went on a CZ um, compilation, Teriyaki Asthma. And then dropped a couple of them and then put the rest on our spanking machine. Joke or whatever, but I read that Spanking Machine and Two Mother were uh, conceptual titles as mm -hmm. to... Was that meant to be a joke or, or not? There was no theme for that. <laughs> Just no joke. God, Our music joke. is no joke. No. I don't know. I, well, she, th she um, named Two Mother for some reasons and I thought of Spanking Machine. When actually... Everything goes together. Like, she thought of Babes in Time and then just little themes offshoot from that. And it's not really conscious. It's just... Kind of, kind of keeping the theme yeah. in a way, but you know, they're also, I think, good titles. The bands I really were rooted into is like the early, like the pop group and stuff like that. I really liked and Patti Smith and, and Carrie Voltaire and all, like the really early, late 70s English bands. You just want to express yourself and be honest to yourself, and that just comes up. I don't know if that's a female point of view or what, but well, it would have to be, cause it, you know. But we don't, you know, we didn't get together and go, okay, this is what we're gonna do. Now let's get this message across and this and that. It's just play from your guts, and hopefully it'll come out, you know, somewhat melodic and entertaining, not just a bunch of noise. How about aspirations for the group, though? Would you like to see it? Uh, just continue at this, you know, just continue doing what we're doing, you know. As, as soon as we start getting all fluffy and old yeah. and stuff like that, I mean, you just, I think people should just know when it's time to quit. There's a lot of bands that should have just ended it a long time ago. But they just continue, and then you just kind of like, every time you see them, you just go, oh, God. Not them yes. still, you know. Foresee your demise before it happens. That's really <laughs> but, embarrassing. Mm -hmm. We just continue doing what we're doing, and see where it takes us. <laughs>